Good morning. Um, so today, continue with uh, Snippy Pixie next. Um, and we want to add a delete command to the CLI. I believe. I think that's where we left it. We've done an add. Um, and I think the next step is delete to make testing quick and easy. So, let's see. We have, this is the daemon, and we've got add snippet. Um, let's build a, delete. Now, do we have tests? We do. Cool. Okay. So we've got add snippet test there. And in the package, delete. Do we have a delete? Oh, we have remove. Okay, remove. Okay. Add, remove. Yeah, that makes more sense, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, we will call it remove, I think. To keep things consistent. You don't really want to do add, delete. It's more add, remove, or create, delete. Yeah. Let's keep it remove. Let's keep it... Um, slightly nicer language okay so we're going to be doing a remove snippet um, and it's with id at the moment which isn't what we want on the front end on a cli you kind of just want to put in the abbreviation so there's two things we can do there we can either do a, on the CLI or the D-Bus, probably the D-Bus, it can take in the abbreviation, see if it exists, getting the ID at the time. Report back either way if it's a prob if it's a problem, um, and just do the delete based on the ID if you found it. Yeah, so we can keep the move snippet with ID here. We're going to do get snippet with abbreviation from the dbus so yeah that's fine okay so dbus you want to do a test um What we're going to do, we are going to do most of this, I guess. Going to create a new manager. We are going to have to also create a snippet. <laughs> so that we can remove it. We might be getting into scaffolding again soon. Hmm. 
Mm. Okay. What if, I wonder, can we do something sneaky here? No, I can't. Just thinking. I was thinking of... Well, we could certainly split this up, I guess. In the package, I think in, we created a little setup, didn't we? Test new manager, skill test snippets. Yeah, we could do something very similar there. Let's take that. Stick that in here. Why is that so close there? Give us the space. So we've got test there. And then here we have should just be snippet shouldn't it and then are we gonna need all that we're gonna be doing I'm gonna do the config stuff Maybe. Yeah, I suppose we do. And then... Yeah, then we'll do that. Create the service. Create some snippets. Sim so it's similar. would be nice to also have standard out I think that could be handy when making sure nothing gets posted or logged rather
Yeah. Let's just take that for a moment. I think we might just use that. I'll just substitute in this stuff here. So replace this what we were using. Okay. Then I'm not going to be returning a database. Oh, yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. Yeah, okay. Let's do it that way. Um, Oh no, we don't need that. We need that's the thing, isn't it? We don't need to pass back a database because it's going to be in the service. Do that, which has a reference to the database and the snippets manager. The one thing we don't have a reference to there. The output. which I'll just add for the moment. But I can imagine that we might want to start passing that around through the service. Maybe not. Uh, so... I guess we want to return a bytes buffer. Uh, even though we're going to give a little test there. We actually want to return the standard out. All right, so yeah, so do is it create the standard out? Do the config. Check that standard out has nothing, didn't go wrong. Create the database, make sure we don't defer close it. Must remember to do that later. Then create a snippets manager, stuff that all into the service. Uh, then 
we don't need that because that was the expected. What we do need is just to call service add. Uh, we don't care about the result. Change that in a sec, but I just want to make sure I get this right. So here we're going to return service and standard out. Why is that complaining? Pass back the address for it then. So let's do here. I think we're just doing. We're not doing the same thing. Yeah, okay. Um. Substitute manager for serve. Okay. So we're going to add a snippet on the service for that, that, that in a random order ish. And we should return. Is it? service okay cool all right so scale test snippets is still fine i think okay um So let's do Am I going to get everything I got? Yeah, I think so. And then I just need to do that defer. Okay. So Test. Service. Remove. Snippet. Passing in. T. As a pointer to test in. T. And then we're going to do, I've got to remember what I have in scale. We have, we 
have is it so we've got is serve and stand and out I want to call it just out so is serve no stand it out equal to scale snippets t need to defer close serve db Um, we want Yeah, and then what we're going to do is we are eventually going to write a function that's going to do so it's going to have a response potentially an error and it's going to be service dot <clears throat> Remove snippet, and we're going to be passing in SP blah. And that means we want that to happen. Now on the remove what do we return? Just a yay or a nay. So hopefully a nil. Okay. Um That's interesting, isn't it? We could because the remove snippet is going to do a get. We could return what we've just deleted first. It's a bit wasteful. I mean, if you're going to delete something, you should already know about it. So let's just do the error. Okay. Let's do the strings thing.
make sure that the server isn't spitting out lots of stuff. Okay. So that's not going to work. Because we have no removed snippet yet. So let's go build that. Can I save that first? I think we'll take that as a starter. It's going to be quite different though. Remove snippet. Removes a snippet. Given that's here, we've given an abbreviation. So we pass in an abbreviation. And we return yay or nay. First thing we want to do is actually we'll pull that. Come snip it. Get some bit with abbreviation. Uh, if there's an error, return nil. Why is that complaining? Oh, return it. Turn it. Nail later on. So we have, in theory, a snippet. Get snippet with abbreviation. What's it going to do if it can't find it? Nail, nail. Okay. So what I'm going to do here
if we don't find one, do we report that? Or we just say, yeah, he's gone. just say yeah he's gone okay so if card snippet is equal to nil turn nil done snippet does not exist ID does not exist. Success. I do, and then we're going to do a remove. So s dot snippets. Remove snippet with ID, current snippet D. If error is not nil, return the error. Otherwise, in theory, jobs are good. Enough. So the service is now hooked up. Get a snippet with abbreviation, make sure it exists. If it does, delete it. Otherwise, an error. Oh, now, good. Okay. Um, so that means the test, in theory, in theory, should run. What happened there then? test
And what is the error then? Because that's pawn and that's called scale. That's causing an error on the add snippet. Oh, it's not a normal error, is it? Can't test it like that. So in add snippet, you just have to do this instead. Because there's a D bus error, it's not a normal error. I had to do it here as well. Equal, uh, yeah. Let's run this again. Pass. Cool. Okay, that's good. So we can remove a snippet. Let's test. Now we can't do a test of get because <laughs> we don't have get yet. Um. Because that could be a phantom remove at the moment. Well, I guess we can improve the test later when we get get service up and running. So we can map it in. Yeah, we could do a try. We could do a try of a get and make sure it comes back in nothing. But for the time being, it's good. Um, so that's all very well for adding the remove there, but we should probably make sure. Well, in theory, that's good. So let's add that. And remove the snippet. Did bus service. And now let's do it on the CLI. So we actually see some, some actual uh, things so we want to go into main and we want to go yeah so here expand that basically one of these Move snippet, it's going to call service, remove, only one argument, which is the uh, snippets abbreviation, and then if we look at Yeah, we're going to need to do that in a minute. Well, I guess we could just add it now. Don't actually have it yet. Let's 
I might give it a short version as well, like rem, but for the moment we'll keep it removed. And it removes snippet. That's the same thing. We want the app name. We want everything after remove to go in as arguments and we want out. And then for the remove, it's going to be a little bit shorter than this. But I will reuse it. Just be trimming out. Of so. Move it says all config based on default command line arcs. Move move. The options are going to be remove abbreviation. Abbreviation for the snippet to be removed. Don't have a body. Do usage still. Didn't turn off my notifications there, did I? Yep, 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 I know. Okay. What are we doing here, I guess? Probably do need to do this kind of thing. So I probably need to do That if flags change the abbreviation, grab it. Otherwise, if the number of args is not equal to one, abbreviation required so 
So if we're setting a flag, we use it. Otherwise, we look at the positionals and take the first positional. It means we can take out this stuff here. So we come in, we pass, look for a deviation flag, use it. Otherwise, look for positional, use position zero, which is the first. Um, if the length of the abbreviation is nothing, then we've got a problem. Abbreviation required. Command is move snippet and we're passing in the abbreviation. Okay. And then in the tests, why have we got an error? Ah. That's right. That's right, because we want to be here. To say it is available as a service. We remove snippet from database. Move takes an abbreviation and returns, in theory, potentially an error. Uh, so Actually returns an error. Okay. So main test. Happy path. It'll be these three, sort of. So we're going to do move. Of that. an abbreviation we expect it to do a remove this should be passing in as an argument just the SP No output. 
here. Long form abbreviation. No body required. Remove again. Nobody there. And no output. Here, same again. No output. Should be a remove. No short form body. So that's that. And then on the fail, we expect it to fail. If you do move nothing um that's a good point we expect it still to pass Because it was basically a, a, a no up. <sighs> so on the remove, when else would we expect it to fail? I guess if we pass in some invalid stuff. So let's try this. I'm not sure if this will pass actually. We haven't tested this yet. Num existent flag. theory, these tests should pass now. Nope, cannot use deeper service type service as type DB service. What? Yeah, I haven't actually added. <laughs> I haven't actually added the debus call yet. Oh. Okay. Um, and where's that complaint? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. That's good. That's nice to know. Um, right. So we need to quickly rip up um, usage of that service. Um, so 
This is in the CLI. It's a CLI. Removes a snippet via the dbus service. Remove. So this is satisfying the interface to be a valid um, client to the dbus service. That's a service call. Remove snippet, it's abbreviation. Now, I guess in theory, I just drop the store because we're not expecting anything else back. Hmm. Okay, we'll see how that goes. Um, if it's not nil, return error. We don't have any snippets, so we just return nil as like, yep, it all was good. Oh, no, I can't. Problem here is right. Type object. I call it. It gets back. I call. And if I get a call, stores the body of the reply into the provide binders. Returns an error if the signatures of the body and return values don't match, or if the error status is not nil. Oh, okay. Might be trouble there. OK. 
Okay. I think I'm totally out of time. I've got one over. Um Just do that. <laughs> we'll see. That might be a bit of a hack. I was thinking I might have to might have to return something. Just so that it says yeah, you're done. Uh, maybe Dbus always expects something in the body. Rather than like a nil or empty. Might have to be a string or something. Just say, yep, yeah, thanks, got it. Or oh, brilliant. Brilliant of success or fail. Or did remove or didn't remove. Yeah. Okay, to do that, maybe return brilliant from. Bus service. Okay, um, yeah, let's do a quick test. So that passes. And what about the config on in it? That passes. Um, so we'll test pass. Things made okay. Just don't make one. Eh? Um, and then here, add it. That should have been okay. If we try and add again, it should fail. If I remove, okay. yeah, there we go. That's the problem with getting stuff back from the D bus. It has to have something. But presumably it did the do. So if I try that again, it works. Um, add again, fails. Add again, fails. Remove. Complains. Remove. Obviously still complains. Add works, fails, remove, okay. Let's do uh, Shall we? Yeah.
Let's change that. Let's make that. Um, just call it moved. And frankly, I don't care about it, to be honest. So we'll leave it for the moment. Yeah. Um, and then in Yeah, I've got to go, but um, I think what I might do. Right, I just need to do a to do here. To do. Um, return bill from the bus service and then the to include in remember to update CLI the tests. Okay. Yeah, I haven't got time to finish this right now. Um, so we'll do that. But anyway, at least it's kind of doing it. Um, I just need to make it a little bit more uh, robust. I guess it would be nice to know whether it actually did remove or not, um, and whether there's an error as well. So I might be changing the signature here. Uh, right, but I've got to go. Um, so thanks again for watching, um, and uh, until next time, take care.